So let's start in the garden section. They have small trellises for things like peppers maybe and lots of different pots. They also had some wind chimes, which I did not know that they had. And they also have a rain gauge here. And this is a pretty um, sturdy looking one. It's pretty tall. So I'm excited to get some more of those for their garden. They also had some seeds and they had one section for flowers, but all the seeds were for, for a dollar. And here are some of the vegetables, which I did pick up. They have a pretty good variety of herbs, fruits, and vegetables. So I'm going to show a little bit of that here. But you have to keep in mind, you may need more of these packages because they do have less seeds. So one of the prepping items, of course, is batteries and they have AA, AAA, C, D, and they also have some of the lithium batter batteries as well. Now, sometimes you can be lucky and you can find brands, but for the most part, they're going to be off brands. They're not going to be as reliable, I would say. So I would keep this in my to-go bags or things like that. Then they also have Super Lou. And usually Dollar Tree, they have all different varieties. So they have all different sizes. So you just kind of have to look and find the best deal or the best value. They also have little kits of screwdrivers, some with um, screws. Of course, this is just for in a pinch. So I would put it in some of the bags to put away because it's better to have than nothing. And then they have an assortment of light bulbs. Next to that, they have duct tape, which is also good to have as well. It's not going to be as good as some of the brands, but again, it will work. It's better than nothing. And they also have some small flashlights. So this is a way to stock up for multiple bags if you have lots of family members. So then they have cold and flu uh, medicine. And, you know, they have liquid tablet form. And they also had some cough drops. And then they have different creams and ointments, which are good as well. They had triple antibiotic ointment, which is something I didn't think that they would have. Then they have ding things for pain. So they have pain relief balm. They have patches. They have colas and hot packs. And then they even have little first aid kits. And I love having hand warmers or feet warmers. Now you can actually sometimes get this cheaper in like athletic stores. Stores that are geared towards more like hunting and outdoor activities. And then they also have these packs of small tissues that I do like to have in, you know, all the cars just for if you run out. They also have wipes too. I don't know if you saw that. And then they have some gauze here and different band-aids. And I also like to get the alcohol prep pads, a hundred of them for a dollar. It's a good price. They also have power to bleach. Now, if you wanted to use this for um, cleaning purposes, you would need to get it unscented and it would have to be um, sanit for sanitizing and not for laundry. That wasn't it. They also have lots of teas. Um, green tea, mint, chamomile. I always like to have those because they can be used for a variety of things. Then they have lots of different seasonings, but I wanted to show the salt. They have the one pound of the Himalayan sea salt, which is the best as far as mineral wise goes. But this is the wide variety of spices that they have. But all of these will be important to add along with your meals. And when they come in these small bottles, they'll be easy for you to take with you. And I found some coconut milk. So I wanted to show that and some apple cider vinegar. Now I do know that they have like vinegar, flour, all of the essentials and smaller packages, but I did not know that they actually had a good, decent size apple cider vinegar. And I wanted to show also they have the toiletries. Of course, everything is a dollar. So it can actually be a good deal when a lot of stores for instance, don't want to give you a, t a box of tissues for less than a dollar. And then also I had just did a video about how you can hand wash clothes with a plunger and bucket. So I wanted to show that they have spray bottles there as well. Then they have foil and they actually had Reynolds wrap. 
I've tried their brand of foil. It's not good. It's one of the few things that I would say never use from Dollar Tree. But like I said, sometimes you can find deals. And then I never knew that they had some vacuum storage bags. So that's really interesting. I'm curious to know if those work. If anyone has tried that, definitely let me know. Um, and then I also wanted to show these as well, these paper bags. A lot of people use them for storing seeds, drying out seeds, but they have a bunch of different purposes. And then trash bags as well. This is all stuff that you can add to each person's bag. Then they also have safety pins and they also have my show pregnancy test. Those will be useful in those days. You probably want to get their ovulation predictor too so that you can try to avoid that when you're in those kind of situations but I wanted to show that they have sewing kits and they've changed it from the sewing kits that they that I've purchased in the past um, I would have to compare to see how good it is but it does have you know needles thimbles um, fabric or thread in there and then I have the strike on back box matches, which I've shown before. I think it's like 155 of them. And I have done in a video about some of the dried fruit that you can get here. They've changed the packaging, um, but you can see some of the ones that I do have. So they have bananas, apples, strawberries, different fruits like that. And it's just freeze dried. So I did want to show that along with trail mixes all of those little snack items that you might want to keep that is going to have at least a year shelf life. So here are the seeds that I got and I'm going to share first seeds that I got from Maureen. Again, she sent um, a separate package and she actually mentioned it in her seed mail video. But um, she had gave me artichoke, organic snow peas that are purple potted, blue bantam, pea seeds, tamarind and baby lima beans and so i got morning glory flowers i'm thinking of doing a blue theme and then i got some sweet corn some forget-me-nots i figure that can go well with the morning glory if I do do a bluish thing. I got some rainbow Swiss chard. Some lavender that says it's a container variety. It says true lavender. Spinach, I always like to get Bloomsdale long standing. It's just a really good variety. Sugar baby watermelons. garden beans. I got the yellow wax ones and I got four of those because I do like to plant, plant a lot of beans. And they're supposed to be nine per square or something like that so I definitely need a lot for um, several feet. Then I got two container varieties of radish. This one's a gourmet and the other one's a french breakfast. And then I got some more chives. Some oregano. I got two of those. And thyme. And I was looking at some seeds around the table, so I knew one was open. It was actually my oregano. But definitely got a lot of seeds for a little bit of money, so I definitely recommend trying the seed variety. I've used it before in the past. And it seems to work really well for me. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I upload every Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday. So like, subscribe, and I look forward to seeing you. Bye.